So, update number five on the Shadio Plus extension. Um, first thing to report was the sealed that gap between the old and the new with expanding foam and plaster. Um, and then this was the last, the south facing wall with the glass bricks was the last one that needed insulation. And uh, so I got that out of the way. Uh, thankfully, I don't ever want to work with that insulation ever again. Um, and then I was looking at um, whether to run the cables in before I put the boarding on. Uh, so I held off on actually panelling them walls out and started on the roof instead. Uh, this was the third piece of plywood, 9mm, going up, which took about half an hour. Sometimes it just slots in, other times it's a fiddly faff. This one was a particularly fiddly faff. Um, once I got the 9mm up on the roof uh, and got that boarded out, uh, I started boarding out with OSB on the walls. Uh, this is the, that's the north wall. Um, this is 11mm. I used for the internal walls, 11mm OSB, oriented strand board. Um, much nicer to work with than MDF, which I used to use. So yeah, there was a lot of that to do. And then um, the beading, finally got the beading in on the uh, double glazing. That made a massive difference thermally and acoustically. Uh, this is the oh boarding out the um the window wall east facing uh this is the more OSB obviously and um I've been uh, there's been a lot of interruptions weather wise uh, so I couldn't get outside finished and there've been a lot of interruptions just with other stuff to do with albums and fireplaces and the like um. So, yeah, it's been slow and steady progress, but I've certainly broken the back of it now. Uh, this is still, I'm still boarding out. Well, I'm not boarding out there, am I? I'm cleaning up. Yeah, that's still the uh, the window wall, finishing that off. There's a bit of a gap, there's a two mil gap there. I'm very disappointed with myself to fill that in with a little bit of trim. And, uh, so yeah, I've gone over the board, over the top there with the uh, the boarding footage. Not that interesting. And uh, that's all in now anyway. I'm going to put another lip on that uh, window edge just to cover up the, um, so it hides the actual plastic frame. So yeah, so I started boarding up the the north wall, um, the south wall. Oh, well, here we go, records have arrived. Um, yeah, I sat boarding that wall up because I want to run all the power and speaker cables in rather than having them on the surface. So the Beatless by Feeler Brasilia turned up. Um, so as I do all the fulfilment, it meant I had to pause. It was a nice place to work in there. It's made for a very good processing workshop. So that was, um, I think it was second or third week in December. Managed to get them all out and shipped. 250 records now with satisfied customers. All the weekend, really. Just got stuck in. There's a terrific twilight at the back of the shed. But there's the uh, flue liner that I had to, uh, with the help of a couple of builders, insert in my chimney for that fire that has been sat there dormant. Well, not even dormant, unused for months. So it's nice to get that cracking, even though I haven't been cold enough to use it, really. So, cladding. Finally, got on with my cladding. Um, 120 millimetre uh, by 12 mil, I think it is, deep. Um, and there were th supposed to be 3.9 metre boards, but they turned up and they were 3.6 metre. So I had to uh, make a little return on the corner just to make up for the shortfall which was I, i'd have done that anyway to be honest i'm glad i did it um 
and this is weatherproofed ship lap as well so i don't have to paint it or treat it um, just leave it as it is. I started out the windowsill and and, uh, and was trying to kind of board down, but gravity, gravity is the way to go. You have to kind of sit them on top of each other. And uh, so this is the yeah, that's the uh, the wall facing the house, the window wall, east wall. Um, getting clad. I think this took about. Uh, well, it was a day everything looks super fast in it and there's the north wall the glass bricks wall obviously going to be a lot fiddlier because i had to um work around the windows well bricks and um so the first boards went up fine and then when i got to the bricks it was jigsaw a go-go and lots of um fiddly cutting in you see the clock in the background there give you an idea of how long it's taking always looks quicker than it is it takes hours right so we've made it up to the bricks here we go offer it up score it where does the little reveal start and then over to the um trestles to notch it all out with a jigsaw and what I did there was uh, I clamped another piece onto the back of it so I got a straight edge uh, so I'm not going to do it all by hand with a jigsaw I don't blow it far too much I like to see using the uh, the edge of another ship lock board as a guide and then um, I'll line the Perfect. So that went up. Oh yeah, I chopped that little lip off that I had over the door because I wanted the the, uh, the cladding to carry on all the way across. Uh, it wasn't really doing much anyway, to be honest. It looked crap. So I just sawed that off and um, reused it, actually. Came in handy for uh, filling in little gaps. So there's the little ship lap joints uh joints uh, sections between the glass bricks tiny little sections and then another piece over the top that also needed to be notched out uh I got rid of the last bit of felt that was hanging out underneath the lip and there it is one shed clad oh well not totally i had to do the door um, did that yesterday on oh, no, a day before coming up to speed now uh, get the door done I've got a bit of a I'm going to put a leather strap to cover that gap or maybe not I don't know if it doesn't bother me that much with it being an external door opening outwards I couldn't I couldn't actually get them flush and this is me and a bit of edging to work up to finishing the porch which brings us right up to speed. That was yesterday's graft. And uh, I can start with the inside properly after the weekend. And hopefully it'll be fit for purpose sometime early in the new year. Well, the last few sections going up, I had exactly the right amount. Wait, the... Because I'd ordered 3 point, I thought I'd ordered 3.9, they sent me 3.6, I was three boards short. Uh, so I got in touch with it, all off marketplace, all the wood, all the timber, all off marketplace, super cheap. Uh, I got in touch with them and sent me the three boards, and which was perfect. And there it is, Shadio Plus clad, finally. Protected against the elements. So, onwards and upwards. Happy New Year to one and all.